You're now an involuntary test pilot. You just changed the shape of your wing mid-flight, and nobody asked you, but you got to deal with it. What do we need to do to land? We need to slow down. So slowing down at altitude after a bird strike does one of two things. If your windscreen's failed, hopefully it's going to decrease a little bit of that distraction of that airflow coming in the cabin. The other thing you want to carefully do is slow down and configure the airplane into a position or an airspeed that you'd be comfortable landing at and making sure that you have controllability through that whole flight regime. If at any point you can't control the airplane, that becomes your minimum speed. Does that make sense? So if you're cruising along at 120, and as soon as you hit 110, you max out aileron, and you can't maintain wings level, guess what? You gotta land at some airspeed above 110. Because if you try to slow below 110, you're not gonna be able to maintain aircraft control. And would you rather lose control up at altitude doing this controllability check, or lose control of the airplane close to the ground on short final? So that's why we do a controllability check. Doesn't have to be anything crazy.